It's become part of the travel ritual. Flyers separating out liquids after authorities uncovered a plot to use liquids to blow up planes headed for the U.S. Anything small, like bottles three ounces or less in a plastic bag, can go on board. But anything larger for carry-on is grounded. Now arriving just in time for the summer travel season is new technology to screen liquids in bottles. There's a scramble among security companies to get these detectors into airports. There is a trial run at Boston's Logan Airport on this device, which sniffs out vapors around bottles. It has been programmed to indicate a certain liquid explosive. I, I can't tell you what that is exactly, as you can understand. For passengers waiting in this screening line, another security check. It sounds good. It may um, prevent us having to throw out objects. I think the screening process is thorough enough. Just turn the unit on. An Ohio company is touting this screener that uses microwave technology, analyzing physical properties of liquids. The unit's designed to really allow benign liquids through. You're looking at uh, drink liquids, water, juice, soda. The Associated Press recently put it to the test. It says it's okay, so I would say it's water. Some bottled liquids were harmless and the machine knew it. Other liquids look safe from the outside. It's a Mountain Dew bottle. But inside, they weren't. I don't know what's in it. The screener caught these. This device already is in airports overseas. The company is talking with security officials about getting it into U.S. terminals. Joining an array of other screening devices like full body scans and biometric screeners using fingerprints. Now a push to make the skies safer one bottle at a time. Ed Donahue, The Associated Press.